Zionist and a war criminal. He said that if support for Israel is in our DNA, no, it's not. What about Palestinian women? So, John, I heard there was an award that was given very recently to our horrible congressperson in the U.S., Nancy Pelosi, and Ireland, some group said that she deserved an award. What was that about? Well, that group wouldn't uh, include me, that's for sure, or yourself, Medea. And, uh, but yes, over the past few days in Ireland, Nancy Pelosi has been uh, treated like royalty. She got an honorary doctorate at UCD. She uh, had a big uh, gala dinner last night, black tie dinner, attended by uh, ex-Prime Ministers uh, Taoiseachs, and a, a big fellowship award as well. And this is coming on the back, as you know, on Saturday, she voted for an extra $26 billion of a uh, military aid to uh, Israel to carry on their genocide and famine. And I think it's an embarrassment to Ireland that given our history of genocide and famine, that during a famine in Gaza, that we're uh, honoring and awarding somebody that is a cheerleader for it. It slaps in the face of our ancestors. And there was a woman who protested Absolutely. You've seen the videos. Yes, we were here last night. We watched the videos after it came out and the, the lady Martha, she was badly handled and ripped out. Her two arms are all red and bruised. Her video has gone viral and right across the world and everybody is asking the same question is, why was Nancy Pelosi treated the way she was in Ireland and given honorary awards, considering not only her support at the weekend, but it's her ongoing support over the years. And correct me if I'm wrong, uh, she's received close to three quarters of a million dollars recently from the Israeli lobby. So what's the name of the woman who protested? Martha. Martha. We say Martha deserves the award, not Nancy Pelosi. Absolutely. Part of the people. Go Martha.